Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wata and I am back. I hope you all are doing good at this time. Hello to all of my subscribers, old and new. Thank you so much for joining me here on Mommy Wata Tarot. I do appreciate you. We're going to see what the messages are this at this time for the collective. Cut the deck on Divine Feminine. Okay, Holy Spirit. Let's see. What are the collective messages at this time, Holy Spirit? What messages do you have for us? Please and thank you, Clever. Divine Feminine, somebody thank you, Clever. And you are. Shit. What else, Holy Spirit? What else would you like for the collective to know at this time? Collective messages from you through me at this time, please. And thank you. That's all, soulmate. Child, let's see. Let's see what pops out. What is the message, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. Messages. Let's go. Pisces. What else for the collective? The book of life. Okay, Pisces, there may have been somebody looking into your Akashic records here. Looking into what the future holds for you. Possibly a Libra. Fight was right behind that. It wanted to come out. Somebody ready to fight about what the book of life has in store for you, Pisces. For a Pisces here. Somebody's upset about that. They're upset about what God, what your destiny is, what God has in store for you. They didn't peek into your future here, a Libra. Because it look like you're going to be bossed up. They ready to fight about your abundance, the prosperity that you're about to receive here. It's a Libra. A, a Libra feel this way about a Pisces. What else, Holy Spirit? Well, cryptic. That's very cryptic. To go and peek into someone's future, try to see what the universe has in store for them. To do what? Hate on it? Try to stop it? This Libra ready to fight about it? That's very cryptic. Why are you upset about what God has in store for another? How about look at what God got in store for you? That's what I'm hearing. Leo. Leo out here now. Now, in that Hitman reading I picked up on this past weekend, there was a Leo who had employed a Libra to do something against a Pisces. Y'all see how this shit coming out, right? Okay. So maybe this Leo employed this Libra to pick a fight with this Pisces because of what their destiny is. Look, moon magic then came out here. And what came out in that reading as well was that the Leo had did some type of spell work on this Libra to control him, to make him more susceptible to what she wanted him to do. He didn't know that part, though, because he had a bone to pick with her. By the time he connected with this Pisces, well, not necessarily connected, but was about to cause some type of chaos and conflict in her life, and he saw that the Pisces was not who the Leo said she was, okay? So something going on with this still. What else, Holy Spirit? Because this shit then came right back out here. And this deck got almost 200 cards in it. We have evolving and sexual abuse. Somebody is healing here. Somebody may be in some type of low vibrational or traumatic energy because of sexual abuse they experienced. It could be any one of these people. Personally, I feel like it's this Pisces. This Pisces has evolved way past any type of moon magic this Leo does, any type of disturbance that this Libra may have wanted to cause for her life, like because she is evolving. And I'm telling you, 
it, it, this woman has healed possibly from sexual abuse and you know for the people in the back people who have suffered from sexual abuse they may never heal from that okay and that type of traumatic experience can really break someone's life if they don't know how to process the pain the guilt the shame that they feel from sexual abuse okay so this Pisces has evolved, healed, possibly from trauma in her past that won't allow any type of spiritual manipulation to have an effect on her. That's what we see in here now. Because it looks like this Leo already tried to do some type of moon magic on this Pisces. And she ain't get the results that she wanted. Okay. Anything else here from this Oracle deck? Child, we got vacation. Hold tight. Don't ever give up the fight. We got fight out here. I feel like this Pisces has been standing her ground to whoever this hitman Libra energy is, as well as this secret hidden enemy in this Leo here. And I feel like she about to be a, be carried away from all this bullshit in a minute. This woman may be actually about to go on a vacation. Or the Holy Spirit is about to give her a vacation from the bullshit. It's really giving something like that here. Okay? Because I feel like these people, somebody mad. These people have been coming for this woman for a long time. But she might got that alien DNA. Okay? And that shit got them obsessed. Because this Leo, that might be what they discovered. Or that Leo discovered that this divine feminine is truly divine, truly special. Does have some type of gifts. Some type of supernatural abilities that this moon magic can't fuck with. Okay? So she sent in this Libra to cause some type of chaos for this Pisces. But that shit ain't worked out. That's what it looked like to me. Let's see. Mm, Holy Spirit. What we talking about the hitman look like again. Holy Spirit, the hitman and who employed him to come for this Piscean energy. Holy Spirit, something is still happening with this situation because this thing came out on its own. I, the Oracle deck at that child. I tell y'all this. I be knowing Oracle deck be hidden. Okay. So Holy Spirit. What other messages do you have regarding this situation? What else do you want us to know about this here please. And thank you Holy Spirit. Let's see y'all. Let's see. I just heard this Libra may be in the military. Or was in the military. The tower then came out here. Somebody in the tower about, and I really feel like it's between this Libra and this Leo that's in the tower. Clarify, Holy Spirit, this is some sort of sudden upheaval. Something has happened, some type of disaster, chaos. Something has occurred for these two people that was coming for this Pisces, I'm telling you. Clarify this tower, Holy Spirit, please, and thank you. Six of Pentacles. For these people coming together, working together to cause some sort of loss for this woman. Something about abundance here. Because we do have this cattle wealth energy out here okay i'm picking up something about this leo felt for some reason y'all and this is why you don't even do this shit because it don't work out like people be thinking it is okay i don't know where they be getting these ideas from but this leo thought that once she peeked into this pisces future into the to into her book of life and learned that this Pisces was going to have cattle, wealth, be very abundant and prosperous. 
this Leo tried to do some type of moon magic to steal this Pisces wealth. And that didn't work, okay? So she teamed up with this Libra and promised him some sort of abundance if he could get rid of her, get rid of this Pisces. Because in this Leo's mind, if this Pisces is, is out of the picture, if this Pisces is no longer able to execute what God had for her life, I can just take over her life and execute it if she's no longer around. This is literally what this Leo is thinking, y'all. This is literally what this woman is thinking. That's why this cryptic shit is out here. Because that's cryptic as all hell. To think that you can literally kill somebody and take their place spiritually. Like, you really feel like you're going to trick the universe into thinking that you this Pisces so that the universe will give you what this Pisces was supposed to have. That's what this Leo think now. That's why this shit then blew up in this damn Leo's face. Because she was going hard, hard to steal this woman's abundance, King of Pentacles. She was going hard to be seen and receive some type of abundance. But, I mean, I'm telling you, the math ain't mathing, child. It just ain't mathing. It ain't mathing. This ain't no damn fairy tale. And maybe people are able to doppelganger others, but only to a certain extent. Because, baby, you can't, you can't duplicate that damn energy. You can't authenticate your energy to appear as another. The universe cannot be tricked. The most, God, most high God know who he allotted certain things to go to, certain gifts to be... Uh, handed out to certain individuals like I'm really getting upset a little bit because I'm like what is going on with this this Leo's mind here that's what I'm thinking like what what's going on with her mind to think that she can actually do this Ju that's why her ass is up under judgment y'all think I'm playing her and this Libra possibly because something has been illuminated about what this Leo was trying to do I feel like she returned to this judgment energy time and time again with these promises of some type of wealth if he could end things for this Pisces. If he was willing to take this bold and erratic action towards this woman. Okay? And this fight energy literally is given like she just wanted him to come in and fuck this woman up real fast. Have her all broken down and defragmented, possibly disabled, so that she couldn't continue to do and be who she is. This is this Leo's thinking. And if this Pisces can't continue to do what she been doing and be who she's destined to be, she was going to take this woman life over. That's, that's what this Leo think. Her energy is out here twice. Very, she was very... Very, very, very determined to do this shit. And something has been exposed about what this woman was doing. Because she kept coming back to this Libra with this bullshit. You know, he was looking at her like, why are you so obsessed with this woman? And I'm telling you, when this Libra went to go see what was up with this Pisces, he did not see anything negative in fact he saw exactly why this leo was flipping out because this pisces is a divine feminine clarify holy spirit and she was promising to share her wealth with him if he was able to do this chariot this pisces is driven this pisces is someone who has made progress in life and is continuing to make progress in her life I don't even think this Pisces knows what all God has in store for her future, but it's beautiful. Somehow this Leo was peak, was able to peek into this Pisces future. And we're going to clarify if she doing it herself or if she got somebody helping her. But this Pisces has willpower, determination, direction, courage, and that's why she going to have a victory. Okay? 
And that's why the universe exposed these people. Something was exposed about what this Libra and this Leo have been doing. What, what, how did they end up in this Tower Three of Pentacles, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. And I feel like it's because this Pisces stood her ground, but stood her ground with God, okay? Because I don't think this Libra ever made direct contact with this Pisces. We have the Page of Pentacles out here. I'm telling you, this Libra, it's a third energy out here. This Page of Pentacles is coming out right behind the Three of Pentacles. There's a third energy, a Page of Pentacles, who helped this Leo do this magic, peer into this divine feminist future, and possibly assist her with trying to steal her destiny. Clarify, Holy Spirit. Clarify this page of Pentacles. Is this a third party here? Because I don't think it. this Leo was, kind of came up with all this. But look, Queen of Swords. Y'all think I'm playing. Queen of Swords. Possibly a Gemini who realized that this Pisces was chosen. Three of Cups right here. This was a whole little conglomerate here. A Queen of Swords, a Libra, and a Leo. Because this Libra is already out here as this judgment energy. He under judgment. He's under judgment and this Leo is up under judgment. For doing this shit right here. Okay? And we gonna figure out exactly what their penance is. Because it's not good. But there was a Queen of Swords. Possibly a Gemini. Who, who discovered that this Pisces was chosen. And that is who was helping this Leo do everything they were doing against this, this chosen one here. Okay? This Pisces is chosen. High Priestess with the Empress. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the confirmation. Like I said, this Pisces is chosen. Okay? And they came fucking with the wrong energy because something didn't ricochet back to all these folks. I feel like this Libra went and saw that he, in fact, was about to do something cryptic to a chosen one, and he thought twice about it. And what came out in that other reading this past weekend is that this Libra had a bone to pick with this Leo now because he could see that she was setting him up for failure. He could see that if he came and fucked with this woman, that things were not going to be good for him in his life moving forward. He knew that shit. He knew he was going to receive some type of penance or punishment if he came for the, and tried to hurt this divine energy. Now some other shit then popped off. Death. Somebody may have passed here. And I don't think it's this Pisces. Four swords on the bottom. I'm telling you, something didn't happen. And, I, and I, look, oh, somebody didn't pass. Somebody has passed here. Endings, rest, retreat, balance. Somebody didn't pass. That's why this vacation energy came out here. Because this Pisces is not going to have to worry about none of these people no more. Because somebody passed. Who passed, Holy Spirit? You know what song is on right now? Raphael Sadiq, Something Keeps Calling Me. And this song was about, he wrote this song about his brother. Who I do feel like committed suicide. His life ended, but it was it was due to his battle with drug addiction. And he couldn't take it anymore. 1919, something keeps calling me. He couldn't take he couldn't take the battle with his drug addiction anymore. That's the song that's on right now. I'm telling you, somebody then passed out of this Libra, this Queen of Swords, and this Leo. Clarify, Holy Spirit. That's the book of life, though. Mm, four cups, child. Somebody has been dis disconnected from the, the 3D, from the physical realm, y'all. One of these people.
The Holy Spirit ain't giving it to me who it is. Somebody just passed though. Somebody, somebody, two of pentacles. Y'all think I'm playing. And, you know, I'm picking up on something, but I'm not even going to say that. I ain't going to say it. Somebody had to go. That's what this two of pentacles talks about. The universe had to weigh their options. They had to make a decision. Because the fact that this Leo kept trying to unalive this divine feminine, this chosen one, that's what did it. They kept trying to come and kill this woman. Straight like that, y'all. And one of these people done lost their life. That's why this thing came back out today. Somebody done lost their life. The universe, and I keep saying it because I keep hearing it, and my condolences. But why were y'all trying to hurt this divine feminine, though? Why, why, why were you even involved in this plot to try to steal somebody's destiny by taking their life on the physical realm? That don't even make sense here. 2112. Someone may have committed suicide. The song cut off right when I said that. What else, Holy Spirit? She would not stop. That's what this fight to this whole tight don't ever give up the fight means. This Leo would not stop. She kept coming back to this Libra, possibly to this Queen of Swords as well, kept returning to these energies in an attempt to hurt this woman. We have the Hermit. The universe, look, the Hermit falling right up under this Leo Sun energy. That's who I think it is, y'all. Y'all think I'm playing. My condolences, but hey, you get back what you give out. And I try to tell people this. They think it's a game. It's not a fucking game. Stop fucking sending these death spells to people. Stop hiring these hit men and these damn drug addicts and these homeless people to come fuck with people and shit because you mad about this, this woman's prosperity, her abundance. This woman healed from some sexual abuse. This Pisces energy ain't have it, have it. The easy way. That's what God is showing somebody right now. You don't know what this woman has overcome. We getting a glimpse of it, but it's a lot. Obviously, this woman had to evolve into this lover's high priestess empress energy. This shit wasn't handed to her. She had to work for that shit. It was destined for her, but it was not handed to her. Okay? And for somebody to think that they going to keep doing this type of bullshit right here to hurt a motherfucker and nothing ain't going to come back on them. Well, this Leo didn't learn today. Okay. To yesterday, whenever she might have learned today, straight like that, because the universe had to make a decision about who needed to go. Who was the, the catalyst? Y'all think I'm playing now? Look what's on the bottom. The universe had to make a decision about who was the main catalyst in this situation. That's that Leo manipulating that Queen of Swords and that damn Libra. The universe seen that shit, and they had to decide who needed to transition with this Six of Swords, who had to go with this Eight of Wands, and it's this damn Leo. Might be this King of Swords, too, because his ass is right behind her ass. Okay? Because I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you something. That shit not cute. Coming to go fuck somebody up and then you fall in love with them because you didn't have some type of spiritual awakening or epiphany. That shit not cute. You know, we're not finna romanticize the fact that this Libra, this King of Swords, was coming in to harm this Pisces. That he was coming in to willingly do this Leo's dirty work. And this Pisces is protected, okay? As we can see, what they wanted for her, it's been blown back on this Queen of Wands. My condolences, that's all I can say. We see that. I told y'all, I, I, I think it was this Leo. Because she was the catalyst. She was the one who was making this shit even be. 
She is the one who went to this queen of swords to peer into this Pisces life and do moon magic on her. She is the one who hired this king of swords to try to cause some type of chaos and even unaliveness in this Pisces life. And I don't think this king of swords is damn um, transition, transitioned on the way from the physical realm. But his ass damn show is facing some challenges, possibly from a law enforcement official. And his ass might be going to jail. Okay? Because like I said, that's cute and all. That this Pisces then woke you up. Then made you realize that there is a God, that there is a higher power. And you can't just go out here destroying people's life. That's cute and all that you, you feel like she is special and divine because she is but this woman ain't fucking with this libra because see that was what was kind of coming out in them other readings that this libra was starting to have feel affection for this this um high priestess empress here this chosen one because he couldn't believe how she had awakened him he couldn't believe how he felt once he was able to see and observe this woman that he was supposed to harm this man that got caught up, this man might be in jail. Either he in jail or he going to jail. Because there's an emperor who knows what the fuck these people been doing. You better know that. Because see, what it's really giving is, is if this is a chosen one, like I'm picking up on, and somebody really was trying to come and hurt her and harm her and shit, this emperor energy was divinely guided to look out for this Pisces. There's somebody watching over this Pisces on the physical realm, okay? Clarify, Holy Spirit. She got an emperor energy who ain't playing the radio about her. Ain't doing it. Clarify, Holy Spirit. King of Cups. Like I said, a King of Cups, Ace of Pentacles at that. Who may want this divine feminine to be his Queen of Pentacles at that, Okay? Like I said, I know what I'm picking up on. These people that fucked up and found out. Fucked around and found out. That's for damn sure. Because this Emperor King of Cups knows how divine this High Priestess Empress is. And he was not going to let nobody hurt this woman. This woman is being was being surveillance by a number of people. Somebody there to protect her and somebody there to try to hurt her. But this Libra might have went to jail for real, child. It's out here. He didn't got caught up somehow. Page of Swords, because like I said, this spying that's been happening, it's been a lot of people spying on this damn divine feminine now. It's too many eyes on her for this Leo to have thought that she could kept sending this Libra back to this Pisces to hurt her. It's too many eyes on this Pisces. See, that's how they asked and got caught up. And I'm telling you, this Leo ain't, ain't with us anymore. Y'all think I'm playing. This Leo ain't with us any longer. Anything else? Page of Wands. Because she continued. She continued to send up energy to the universe about this divine being. Because, see, my thing is, this how you know people don't know what the hell they be playing with, with this spiritual shit here, okay? Because this, this is what my mind would have went to. Well, if I'm doing magic on this person to try to steal their fate, and I'm calling on the universe to... Help me steal the fate of the person that the universe chose to have it. Why would I think the universe is going to give me good news in return? Th that's what this Leo should have said to herself, y'all. But she didn't do that shit. She really thought that she was going to call on the universe, call on the spiritual realm to help her unalive and steal this woman's destiny. The same people who gave this woman her life and her destiny. Any final messages, Holy Spirit? 
but that's how the cookie crumbles. What you get, what you put out, that's what you get back. That's that karma, baby. And this damn Leo wasn't expecting to get back what she put out. I'm telling you, my condolences, because I know what I'm picking up on. Somebody didn't pass, and it was this Leo for damn doing what she had been doing, trying to unalive this Pisces. This been going on for quite some time. This was a very cryptic individual. And now the fact that I'm even saying something about her in past tense, I just saw the word transition again. I just saw it. My eyes went right to it. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Nine of Swords. There's some people grieving right now. There's some people mourning and grieving right now. But this is what happens when you down, sit up, and continuously come for a chosen one. This is how the cookie can crumble. Somebody then passed on. And it was this Leo energy who continuously tried to cause misfortune and loss for this Pisces. Now this person, person's family is facing misfortune and loss. I'm telling you. And I'm dropping the mic on that. Because see, God don't like ugly. And he ain't too funny. Ain't too fine. Don't, don't fuck with it too much with that pretty either, okay? He fuck with the right and the wrong, okay? That's what he like. He like the right. When you know you could choose to be wrong and you choose to do right anyway, that's what he like. Because this, whoever this Leo is, this Leo had ample opportunities to stop doing this shit. It's out here. She continued to come to this hit man to try to get him to hurt this damn chosen one. Continuously. Even after this hitman could see. That this was nobody he needed to do. Even the hitman could see. That this was not nobody that he needed to be fucking with. Now look what didn't happen. But I digress. I hope this message helps someone. I hope it gives you insight and guidance on how to move forward. But always remember. If it doesn't apply. Please let it fly. I'm going to tell y'all what I just heard. I heard it back here, but I didn't want to say nothing. This hit man didn't unalive this Leo. That's what didn't happen. That's why his ass in jail. This hit man has unalive this Leo for lying on that woman, for pulling him into that bullshit. Y'all should see me. I'm pointing my finger, Holy Spirit, because it don't make no type of sense. It don't make no sense. Okay? This Leo met her demise at the same, at the hands of the person that she was paying to demise this damn empress here. Y'all think I'm playing. I had to go get another deck because I heard that back here with this death four swords temperance energy. And I just heard it again. And the Holy Spirit says, that's the truth now. That's why he in jail. Because I was trying to figure out why he in jail. Because, see, they already had started watching this Libra and this Leo, this emperor had, once he found out what they was trying to do against this Pisces. Okay? And this Libra then, then unalive this Leo. This karmic little couple here they got going on whatever the fuck this was clarify what i'm picking up on though please and thank you holy spirit did this libra unalive this leo i could be wrong we got the hierophant i'm telling you this man that went to jail because he didn't unalive this woman y'all think i'm playing the emperor y'all think i'm playing I'm telling you what I'm picking up on now. This is court, law enforcement, criminal justice system all day, baby. All day. What else, Holy Spirit? Death. For lying to him. For putting him in this position. For causing some type of mental duress in this man. Because I'm telling y'all, somebody need to go watch. 
that King of Swords reading on my other channel, and it's from this past weekend. It says the hitman has a bone to pick with a Leo because she put him on to somebody that he knew he should not have done nothing against. Now, y'all see what then came out here, right? Anything else, Holy Spirit, I'm not going to poke or pry any longer. Anything else? Anything else you want us to know? Ace of Wands. He took this action against this woman. Y'all think I'm playing now. And he went to jail for it. But see, she was putting spell work over this Libra as well. That also came out in, this, in that other reading. So is she doing spell work on his mind? He already really ain't in his right mind because he out here being the hit man. And then he comes across a chosen one, a divine being, who makes him discover God in a sense. Like, I don't feel like he discovered God. I don't feel like he completely picked up the principles of God because he showed and did this. Okay, but it all of that mixing around that caused some type of delirium, some type of cryptic energy in this Libra as well. Because this Leo kept being cryptic, kept trying to get him to do some more cryptic ass shit. Crypt, what is a crypt? Do you know what a crypt is? I'm telling you what I'm picking up on, but I'm dropping the mic. So if one of y'all, if you was this high priestess. Empress Pisces here. The hitman got rid of your enemy for you. And he and the law enforcement, this emperor here, then got rid of this hitman for you. Okay. Damn, it's like something telling me to say to hit it one more time. Something saying hit it one more time, Holy Spirit. Six of Wands. And my dear, you have gotten the victory. Your ass about to probably go on vacation for real. Clarify. The devil out here. You won a victory over... These people try to hurt you. And the Most High God stepped in and balanced this situation in your favor. I had just picked up on something. I'm going to get up on up out of this. I hope this message helps someone. I hope it gives you insight and guidance moving forward. Just know God don't play about you. Pisces, Divine Feminine. Okay, God don't play about you. Just know that. And this emperor don't play about you either, but I, I'm not finna get into him. None he got going on. That ain't my business. But just know God don't play about you. And I digress. But again, y'all, if it doesn't apply, please let it fly. Take only what resonates. Leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one. Peace.